to these people. You know, oh, I'm yeah, I'm so sick of these people, man. I don't know what to say, man. This video was supposed to be like a happy video, checking on the list who is coming to America and all that. The list is not there yet but it might be out by the time you watch this video because it takes time to record and edit the video and all the good stuff but by the time you watch this video the list might be there who is in and who is out chelsea are coming to america tonight they have the first game on wednesday against west Ham at uh, santa clara california and this came out of the blue just like a bomb Trevor Chaloba is not going to make it because Chelsea are trying to force him out of the club. We know how this is done, you know? Try to freeze you in order to force you out of the team. And this kind of treatment is not acceptable for Trevor Chaloba, who always there for the club since the age of seven, who, who has done everything for the club, very solid, never complained about anything very cheap in terms of salary 65k every single week when malangsa was getting 120k every single week he's on free he didn't spend any kind of money so the treatment that he's getting is really ridiculous and evil i'm not happy about it i'm gonna make another video at some point to give you more details but if this is the way you're going to treat your own kid from the academy and you go around the world and spend crazy, ridiculous amount of money buying Wonder Kid that you don't even know if they're going to perform good at Chelsea Football Club, this is a disgrace. So the news came first from this account here, the Chelsea Spot. So we have to confirm. Let's wait and see if the club might change it because of the backlash going on on social media right now but i think the decision is made and he been forced out Manson mount was forced out in another way in a more intelligent way which is taking the contract out of the table and then try the pr movement to paint him as money grabbing he doesn't love the club blah 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 everybody believed it because people hate academy people hate english player so the pr on Manson mount worked pretty good the pr on conor gallagher might work also pretty good because they might offer him a contract 70k a week he rejected and then it's gonna be like oh he's looking for money he wanted to live for money we offered him a contract you offer somebody a contract that you know he's gonna refuse so you can paint him as money grabber greedy evil he doesn't love the club blah 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 we know well not everybody knows but anybody with a certain level you know a certain education will understand how pr work but it is what it is my friends so this is Trevor Chaloba when he got his new contract, 70 or 65K a week. Todd Bowley uh, gave a, a big, good speech and how they're going to protect our academy, our identity and all that. But everything that they are doing right now is to, to erase, to, to completely delete everything that Roman Abramovich built sell every player from that era sell you know or get rid or suck everybody from the academy from the first team from so they can restart their own project without any kind of emotional attachment so it's going to make it very easier for them to sell and buy sell and buy because you have no attachment to any player so this is what they are trying to do this is a piece of business I just hope that it works though if it works on the pitch that we are winning games it's not gonna be a problem but if it doesn't work on the pitch it's gonna be a huge problem in my opinion okay so very quickly caleb wiley was confirmed as a chelsea new signing 
and he's gonna join Strasbourg online. Online or on loan? I can't even speak. I'm so discouraged about uh, Trevor Chaloba news. So yeah, you understand that this video is not gonna have the same kind of energy and excitement. So they announced him today, left back, wing back, winger, midfielder, very versatile, and probably he's gonna play for Chelsea first team in the future. This news here came from Fabrizio Romano, exclusive Chelsea make initial approach for Villarreal Philip Jorgensen as potential new goalkeeper. Talks started on the player side with uh, Swedish goalkeeper keen on the move. Early stages for sure, he is one of four names under consideration at Chelsea Football Club. Mead Hermanson from Leicester City also is appreciated. No talks for Mamastvidic. Can't pronounce his name really. Mamastvidic. 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 Hmm. It's going to be difficult if we sign this guy. It's going to be like the way I, I used to be Arisa Balaga to pronounce his name. It took me like weeks to practice how to pronounce Kepa Arisa Balaga and Caesar Aspiliqueta. We always got some very complicated names when it comes to players and goalkeepers. All right, people. And we move. Malang Sa, the legend himself. His contract being terminated by Chelsea Football Club in mutual consent. He doesn't care anymore. The guy made crazy amount of money in three years. He made more money in one year than Manson Mount in his entire career at Chelsea Football Club. And Mount was there in the club for more than 24 or 25, 23 years or 20 years since when he was six right so let's say for 20 years of your career at chelsea somebody came from nowhere and got money in one season more money than you made your entire life at chelsea but if i ask for a better salary for myself i'm greedy i don't love the club i am money grabber that's how it works at Chelsea Football Club when it comes to those academy product and English players. They don't deserve anything. Because why? Xenophobia, tribalism. So Malangsa, he doesn't care. You cancel his contract. He's living as a free agent. He's going to have sign-on fee and he's going to be on decent salary over there. It's not like they're going to pay him 100k a week. French players or French league don't have even money. Some players over there are like on 5K a week, 10K a week, 20K a week. So Malangsa, even if he's on 20K a week, he already made crazy ridiculous amount of money at Chelsea. He doesn't care anymore. Now it's time to go and enjoy football. But you know what? The guy won the club World Cup with Chelsea. It's all good. Conor Gallagher is another guy that Chelsea been pushing and trying to push him for years. He doesn't want to go on Chelsea's terms. He want to go on his own terms. But it looks like, uh, you know, Atletico Madrid are getting closer and closer to signing Conor Gallagher. And keep an eye open on Omoro Dion because this could be a package deal here where Chelsea can get a good deal for Omoro Dion and Conor Gallagher going the other way. Mm -hmm.